The Honourable Member for Parkdale High Park. Mr. Speaker, I rise today to commemorate the 57th anniversary of the Tibetan National Uprising. On March 10, 1959, thousands gathered in front of the Potala Palace in Lhasa to rise up against injustice in Tibet. That year, His Holiness the Dalai Lama, an honorary citizen of this country, and 100,000 other Tibetans became refugees. Mr. Sp Speaker, His Holiness and thousands of other Tibetans are now seeking a path of return. They are pursuing an approach called the Middle Way. The Middle Way seeks nothing more than greater autonomy for Tibet within China. It is an approach that would peacefully resolve the issue of Tibet and bring about the stability and coexistence between the Tibetan and Chinese peoples based on the concepts of equality and mutual cooperation. Mr. Speaker, it saddens me greatly that in a desperate attempt to raise more awareness about the cause of Tibet, 151 persons have self-immolated. Those deaths should never have been necessary. On the 57th anniversary of the 1959 uprising, it's up to all of us to focus on raising awareness about the Tibetan cause. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.